this space is tight I'm running out of air And for the moment you all can Being in the, sort of the, the breaking wave of history and seeing these remarkable things that have you know been taking place in our world to, to be able to go and see it for yourself is, yes. um, is, is a privilege and it's, it's a real it's an honor what is good news yes well it's interesting everybody says they want to see good news but uh, but people don't really watch good news I mean I, you know um, people say they would like to see nothing but a good news a newscast that had nothing but good news but in truth you know I mean I, I think um, news is often you know is often bad. It's often things, you know, disasters that have happened or, or conflicts that are occurring. Um, but but I think you know, uh, for me, good news is is uh, is, is something that um, helps that that helps somebody who's watching. That it teaches them something. It, it helps them learn something and something that they can apply in their own life. I, and it wasn't. I, I just wanted a job answering phones. I I, want, <laughs> I was applying for the lowest level job you can possibly get. My Yes, basically the mailroom, yes. essentially, and um, I couldn't get the job, so yeah, so I came up with a plan, which was I, a friend of mine made a fake press pass, and I borrowed a camera, and I started going to wars, and I figured if I went places where there weren't many, where a lot of people were scared to go, that I wouldn't have much competition, and I would be able to start telling stories. Yeah, you know, my brother uh, killed himself the, right before my senior year of college, he was 23 and I was 21, and... You know, with with suicide, uh, there's obviously many questions you know one has about why somebody did that. I kind of wanted to be places where people talked about real things and about life and death, and, and people were facing real challenges. And so that's sort of why I started going to the war zone. And that's why I, uh, you know, I kind of wanted to learn from them about how to survive and um, and, and and be someplace where where that language, that language of loss. Was I'll fight you